Hello world, hello Germany, hello Dortmund. I'm Irony Singleton, AKA T-Dog from The Walking Dead. I hope you watch that show. We're here at the weekend of hell. If you're not here, you're missing out. You want to get here, it's going on tomorrow also. I, I want to say I love you all. Thank you for loving the show, for supporting the show. Take care of yourselves. You love each other. It's free. It doesn't cost a cent. I love you guys. Take care. Bye. My character bit the dust. That's an expression. My character died in season three, episode four. But the way he died is so memorable. And you all have immortalized the character T-Dog. It was such a heroic death. He died saving Carol before he could even get a batch of her chocolate chip cookies. So that's the most disappointing thing of, of all about his death. Yeah, but that was uh, one of the most memorable things was that the executives and the writers, they thought so much of me that they gave me an honorable heroic death. And that's the best way. If we're going to leave this earth, I think that's the best way to go out saving somebody else, right? Helping to make humanity better. A lot of people have complimented me and said that if T-Dog didn't save Carol, then Carol would not have saved everybody else at Terminus, the rest of the group, Rick and Daryl and Glenn and so on and so forth. So they said the show wouldn't be in existence today. I'm like humbly thankful for that, but that means a lot to hear stuff like that. Yeah. Now, I want, I want to talk to you guys about this book right here. It's called Blindsided by the Walking Dead. And I talk about my time on the set in The Walking Dead, uh, particularly in this book. But overall, it details my life story and how I grew up and where I grew up. I grew up, if you are familiar with the United States, I grew up in a, a, a town in Southeast uh, US. It's called Atlanta, Georgia. And it was a housing project. And if you've heard anything about housing projects in the US, then you know that that was not the best living situation. It was like a world of its own. And I ran the streets and I, I carried a gun, I fought. I had my fair share of fights, I sold drugs, and I lost my mother when I was 18 years old. She died from HIV complications, and before she died, she was an alcoholic, and she was addicted to drugs. But because God is so amazing, that, that power that we don't see, but we feel all the time, and we experience all the time, that power intervened in my life, and I ended up at a university called the University of Georgia. Go dogs. So if you're big on college football, that's the team right there. And I played football at the University of Georgia where I also majored in theater. And after I graduated from college as a theater major and a speech communications major, I moved to Atlanta. I did several shows for free. I worked for free. So if there's anything you want in life, a lot of times you may have to do free work first before you get to the point to where you're satisfied. So I did lots of free work before I got my opportunity in a movie called the Blind Side with Sandra Bullock. So that was a big movie. Um, you know, had worldwide appeal. And that movie led to The Walking Dead. So I tell that entire story. I tell that, not the entire thing, but I tell that in this book in about 200 plus pages. It's a great read. It's very inspirational. It's motivational. So if you're anybody that's dealing with any type of pain or, 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 or hardship in life, this is the book to have, and I think that's every human being, right? Because we all have our trials and tribulations. But this book will help many people get through that. It will let you know that no matter what you're going through, you can always overcome it with perseverance, faith, determination, commitment. You never quit, never give up. That's what this book teaches you. This is my acting school here. And it's called Irony School of the Arts. Although it's located in Atlanta, Georgia, Atlanta metro area, I do Skype teaching as well. So if you're interested in becoming an actor, now, mind you, I said actor, not a big star, because it's really not about becoming a star or a celebrity. It's about contributing to the arts and making the world a better place, which is the reason why I got into the arts. Now you can contact Irony School of the Arts. It's ironysa.com. Right. Oh, right there at the bottom. See that? IronySA.com. 
contact us so that you can take acting classes or it would even help you with your, your speaking. So if you're not interested in becoming an, an actor, but it will help you become a better speaker, just a better communicator overall. Alright, so check out my school everybody. Alright, hello everybody. This is the time that I do not look forward to and that's the time where I say goodbye. I will miss you all. Until next time, I love you Germany, I love you Dortmund, I love you world. Love each other, like I said earlier, it's free, it doesn't cost a dime, alright? That'll make the world a better place, take care of it. <laughs> hey, how you doing? That's very nice, oh my goodness, yes.